in search of soil. Clay works synergistically with organic matter. The clay minerals help to stabilize humus, soil humus, slow down its rate of decomposition, and help to hold not only nutrients, but water in the soil. So conceptually, and this is done in some parts of the world, I could put clay into a sandy soil and mix it up and throw in some manure and other organic residues. And I could turn a really lousy sandy soil into a nice productivity, a nice high productivity soil. I could make a brand new soil, a high quality soil out of a sandy mess. Um, one of the key problems with sandy soils is they have low water holding capacity. If it rains, most of the water just percolates through the sand and goes on down into the subsoil. So if it doesn't you know, I could plant a seed in there, uh, and if it rains every other day, you know, I'm going to grow my crop. But if you get a three-week period with no rain, that plant runs out of water and dies for lack of water. In a clay or a nice loamy soil where I've got a mixture of sand, silt, clay, organic matter, has a much higher water holding capacity. It's able to, with the plant is then able to live on reservoirs of water that are retained in that soil and get through that three week drought until the next rain comes and then keep growing. So the resilience is what that combination of clay and organic matter add to that soil, which is why it's so much better. You know, you can, um, uh, you can grow, you know, great crops in sandy soils if you're, if you've got a, a fertigation system. So you're irrigating it and putting in nutrients and you're spoon feeding those in, uh, you know, you can do it. Absolutely. but you've got to have a very high level of management to do that. You've got to spoon feed both the water and the nutrients to the crop in a, in a sandy soil. Whereas in a loamy soil, you've got a much more robust and resilient system. And it requires quite frankly, less management to get a good crop out of it. Hi, everybody. Thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get the latest from the show. Also, be sure to check out some of the great clips and watch the full interviews right here on In Search of Soil.